Welcome back. We're talking about Well McLean's Slim Fit Boiler, and this segment we'll be talking about the components of this boiler. Let's start off with the venting uh, features of this boiler. We have our fresh air intake on the top. We have our exhaust coming out in the front of the boiler. Our typing type of material that can be used is Schedule 40 PVC, CPVC, stainless steel AL294C, or polypropylene. Now our venting lengths are up to 150 feet for the Slim Fit 1000 and 100 feet for the Slim Fit 1.5 and 2 million BTU boilers. Also you can see here during the front of the boiler that we're seeing right now, we have our piping. This is considered a left hand boiler. So not only do we have three sizes, we do have a total of six different configurations. So each boiler has a left and a right hand feature with piping. The, mo mo the one you see here right now is a left hand feature because if you can stand here and look at it, the piping is coming on the left hand side. If it was on this side, it would obviously be a right hand boiler. On this side, we have, uh, let me start here. Another way to tell, looking at the clean out plate on the side of the boiler, if the piping is coming on the left side, it's a left hand boiler. Looking at the clean out plate, if the piping was coming out on the right hand side, it's considered a right hand boiler. Also on this side of the boiler you're going to have your gas hookup and if I didn't say so this is your supply at the top and return out the bottom. One other area I want to discuss is our slim fit solar control. This control guides the boiler, operates the boiler, we can sequence up to eight boilers uh, all by uh, within the control itself. Uh, you can lead lag and rotate the boilers with this control. A little more information about our components. Let me show you where they are. And if you haven't noticed how easy it is in toolless entry to access the boiler's components. Located in this part of the boiler, we have our solar control. Uh, again, that could lead lag and rotate up to eight boilers uh, if your application so desires. Clean out plate. Easy to maintain this type of boiler. When you remove this clean out plate, it gives you total access to all the heat transfer pins that are inside. We actually give you a little tool to be able to knock all the residue down and be able to wet wash this if, if you desire to clean that access area. Components inside. Again, our solar control. And look at the spacing we have here. I mean, this is wide open, so easy to service. I mean, your gas valve, you can get behind it through it. I mean, you can practically walk into the boiler. It's crazy, huh? But you have your low and high gas pressure switches. We have our uh, a basic uh, uh, dual seated gas valve, which again can be tested through CSD1 technology, uh, uh, CSD1 um, um, controls and safety devices um, through the technology of the solar control, and it can be tested that way too. So your gas line through, your gas train comes again through the front of the boiler with your water uh, supply and return lines. Combustion blower motor inside there. Again, easily accessible, easy to work on. Panels come right off. And by the way, the solar display comes factory set up on the same side of your clean out. It kind of helps you remember not to put this side of the boiler against the wall so you can get into the clean out, but if you need to, you can remotely remove this and install it here. These panels are the same size, the side or the back of the boiler. So your solar control can be relocated from here or to the back of the panel. Located on top of the boiler, I want to show you some more components that we have. We have our low water cutoff test button and reset. We have our control reset and our power switch. Located on top of the boiler is our access panel to the additional components. Along with that, on the same access panel is your wire and schematic, your pictorial as well as your ladder diagram. Again, toolless entry to the top of the panel. Underneath that panel, 
you're going to find our solar control. You're going to find our Honeywell igniter, along with our minor components, and our low water cutoff. Another important component to this slim fit boiler by Well McLean is the condensate trap. Condensate trap must be installed. Easily done, but prior to installation, I wanted to show you that underneath is an adjustment to level the unit so it helps support the condensate trap after installation. Installation of the condensate trap is very easy. Underneath, and you're going to screw it right onto the access point of the heat exchanger's base, snug, tight, make the adjustment as needed, and you're all done.